Today at Dover International Speedway, Miles the Monster stands guard over a track that will swallow up cars, engines, and of course, egos. It's a concrete canyon of broken dreams and only one winner. Drivers, start your engine! Sun is out, the cars are fast. Here we go at the Monster Mile. Green and white checkered flag is waving for driver of the double zero, Cole Custer, who has now claimed his third stage victory of the year. Once again, Custer takes the outside lane as we begin our second stage. One back here, one side to two, barely there. You know, Justin did a great job on that bottom lane, staying even with Cole, even though he's not going to be able to stay side by side with him. He did a great job, and hopefully he'll, he's hoping he'll still be able to be in second here. Cole Custer said, Miles the monster? Are you kidding me? He's just <laughs> punched him right in the nose, led every lap so far, and he swept the first two stages here at Dover. Logano laid it on him at Bristol, oh. and are we going to get a caution? Yes, we are. Oh. Kaz Grala goes around. Hey, I that, thought he was going to save that, too. That was, he was sideways from the middle of one and two all, all the way to turn two. He got a little loose in, and then he got real loose when he got hit. <laughs> that, that, uh, that'll that make you looser when you get hit in the left <laughs> rear a little bit. And, and, you know, I think that was just a deal of he got loose in, he had to check up, and, and John Hunter just tried to probably honestly just get him a little bit loose with air uh, just to try to get under him in the next corner and uh, just might have tapped him a little bit there but that's hard to over racing we've said it many times the easiest place to pass on pit road and winning the battle off the pit lane christopher bell he'll be out front for the first time another win another one hundred thousand dollars for bell great job on pit road thank you tony celebration is on for christopher bell third victory of the season the 11th of his career, and he's picked up another $100,000.